Three. Hey, this is Will and Corey Robertson. We just got off the phone with our good friend Jeremy, who's with Preemptive Love, and uh, he's in Syria right now, and I'm sure you've heard the news about Syria and the atrocities that are going on there with the chemical weapons, and so these guys are on the ground and trying to help kids, trying to help families uh, with food and shelter, and they need our help. Yeah, the thing that Jeremy told us this morning that I just thought was so profound, he was like, we just don't want the people there to lose hope, and we don't want you guys to lose hope either because there is something we can do, and we are doing a lot. We just need more help. We just need more funds, and we can help more people. And, you know, as they as they start rebuilding and as they start cleaning the houses and all that, it just takes so much work, and it takes money. And so Willie and I had an idea. So we texted a bunch of our family and friends, and we said we want to do a matching funds. And we raised $106,000 in matching funds. And all we are asking you to do is we need 100 of you to go online to houses and all that. It just takes so much work and it takes money. And so Willie and I had an idea. So we texted a bunch of our family and friends and we said we want to do a matching funds. And we raised $106,000 in matching funds. And all we are asking you to do is we need 100 of you to go online to go to Preemptive Love website the link is in our bio and to just become a sponsor as you donate monthly it makes an incredible impact for these people over in Syria and you know they're over there just being the hands and feet of Jesus they're taking care of the least of these taking care of the sick and the poor and you know exactly what Jesus called us to so we want to support them in this and we feel really called to this and um, so get on there and donate I will do the same with all of my heart to love you, cherish you, and to never leave you. There's a, a flower you can kiss from underneath it. so thankful for you and I am so excited for the new journey we are about to have in holding hands through life's ups and downs and get to heaven together. Hey, uh, this is Willie and Corey Robertson here. Uh, we've been on the show Doug Dynasty and uh, but today we want to talk a little bit about um, children and uh, kids that are in the foster program, kids that need adopted. Uh, Corey and I have uh, adopted uh, some kids ourselves, and uh, it's really one of the best joys that we've ever done uh, is to create that forever family uh, for children. And so it's impacted our lives, and it's uh, for sure impacted their lives. Uh, and really just helping out families that either can't take care of their children or um, just through bad circumstances, kids end up without a family. And uh, certainly it's not their fault. And so uh, we just kind of wanted to shine a light on that, uh, give give their voice and uh, uh, just create some awareness uh, that there's a lot of kids out there that need help. We've been spending the day with kids who are in need of families and um, you know right here in America there are over 400,000 kids in the We've been spending the day with kids who are in need of families and um, you know right here in America there are over 400,000 kids 
in the foster care system in need of temporary families, but there are also about 100,000 kids that are in need of forever families, that the parental rights have been terminated and they need a mom and dad, and they're really just waiting on a mom and dad. And I feel like it's something that we don't talk about a lot, but it's just right here in our backyard. And we just really, spending time with these kids today, it just, I mean, they are just some sweet, sweet kids. And they're just, you know, needing that forever family. So I can't think of a better cause. It's something that we're really passionate about. It's something that God is really passionate about. He talks about it in the Bible. And he gives us a really direct charge to take care of orphans and um, take care of the little children. Well, and I know that there's people out there who, uh, uh, maybe this is on your heart, and um, I know there's people out there who certainly have the means and the houses and all the nice things that we have in America. And so uh, I really call on you to pray 